Hello everybody, welcome back to another AI video. In this one, we're in ChatGPT, and we're not in any ChatGPT, we're in GPT-4 here, and I want to show you how to enable and install plugins. It's time, they're being rolled out right now as we speak. I just got accepted, and if you haven't been accepted yet, you should be accepted soon. And here it is, all you gotta do is, you're probably on 3.5 to start, course click on GPT-4 the other options you can go down here to the left side click on those three dots or the ellipses go to settings and then under settings you'll see beta features make sure that plugins is turned on just like I did there okay good now up here at the top when I hover over GPT-4 you'll see it says default and then it says plugins make sure there's a check mark there and then click on it now it says no plugins enabled right here let's just drop that down and presto we're going into the plugin store and then you get a little little bit of a blurb here they're powered by third-party applications not controlled by OpenAI. standard stuff if you agree to all of this stuff click on OK and then let's see what we get holy smokes we've got well we've got we've got eight on this page and then we've got eight pages down at the bottom here let's see if that's it so we have 64 we have at least 61 plugins out of the box so that's a hell of a lot. I don't know how they've ranked them and if they're just in chronological order or uh, alphabetical order. I don't know. But this, let's go to most popular. Here we go. So here it is, guys. This is how you add them in. I hear Expedia is a really good one. Um, Zapier, Wolfram, of course. So that's how you add them. Thanks for watching.